Wagwan Wadao. This is the 97th podcast with Dante, Frank and me and Trevor. Na ikibamba sana unaweza Twitter three men nami. Ushawahi date dem anapiga wanate? Alafu nasikiza mama piano. Ba, sana mwade muda ndio matatu. Wagwan Wadao, welcome to the 97th podcast. This is episode 9. Episode 9 na tuko hapa hivi na my Gs Franky Monty unajiita mara mbili umeanza kutumia miadarati si ndio nataka kunona ulianza kutumia miadarati i want to become many tuondoka kwanza episode 10 tufanye upside down eh wala eh inaweza die kama spider man inaweza die deadly so episode, episode 10 ukiata visuals hauna bahati hiyo <laughs> nani kweli utakuwa eh. umeuma nje umeuma special one umeuma outside anyway franky trevor and uh, dante hapa hivi 97 podcast tumekuja kuharibu na cheki anaitagwa Trevor Andrew amepolea pale anaeka mguu wake juu eh msana mguu mwingine ni ndo eh chungulio unsee nilipima na mguu mwingine big unsee nilipi big hiyo namba 45 4 it depend kani sneakers ni 4 yani karibu mke drink na hiyo kama ni official shoes ni 5 amenuliza kani 44 45 namwambia kani sneakers 44 kani of you bwana kaka kwamba ndaku nibaya kiatu na kuna akuna de machine by yake to come to think of it sasa ta bai wapi ii kwani mimi nanuanga wapi ah hizi lazima viatu zako zinzile wanapimanga wana mm. <laughs> unakuja wanaangalia length width uangalie hapa hivi inataka waje ankle zima chana distance gani trevor ile siku ndapata umepost mahali at shoes by mm. ndakupiga nitakuchapa nitakutandika at shoes by nisipost nitakuchapa simbiz Hapana uh, unajua kuna biz afu kuna nini enterprise Kesho <laughs> yako berekana kwa enterprise peke yake Kesho Adam Plant kwa anatosha na shoe size Alikuwa pia anapiga 244 yake strong na anakuwa manayo Adidas pale Puma ndani Nike Air Force Black Alikuwa na issue wapi Hani wale wasana wonge na mboro ndani ya mdomo Ni western Hata <laughs> kucheka Na huko kwetu Bumala Lakini pia unajikakamua bwana <laughs> Unajua shida ushago ushago hakuna tv tu ndogo ndogo sijui 3 seconds <laughs> Ule ni msichana ako busy mambo yake ni mingi kuna unga huku kishagi mtoto analia kwa mto mahindi iliangukia ndama anaenda kosha mtoto kwa mtu akachelewa eh akaacha mtoto amelala kwa maji nimechelewa hapo hapo kwa mtu kidogo unanipata <laughs> ushago mtu anatokanga mkono tupu anarudi kichwa ni kuni unga kwa ndoo anavimboga kwa makopa nyanya kwa mfuko azinaocha unaweza toka hivi urudi hivi na chakula mzima dinner tu umebeba tu hivi mtu mmoja hivi unaongelea experience nimeona unaongelea experience eh nishai kwa ocha nishai nishai palilia wadau kuna kitu inaitwa nga robo pale kitale ulipaliliwa au ulipalilia nipalilia ndugu yangu pale unapewa shamba kuota eka unalipwa tatu kwa siku ndugu yangu si kwa siku mpaka hiyo robo ishe <laughs> robo ni kuota <laughs> Umeita kuota robo. Na eh, si ilikuwa inaitwa ngaivo. Ilikuwa inaitwa robo. Na pia usipochunga jamaa za kulipa tu na mahindi ndugu yangu. Mana <laughs> exposure. Vibaya sana. So, so exposure ya ocha unajua ni unapua punda uende maji nayo kwa mtu. Mi experience yangu ya ocha ni wase kungangania shamba. Kuna siku fulani budango kwa mejenga ocha sasa ndo alikuwa na try kujenga for the first time. Unajua budake budaki alikuwa mtu wa wake wengi sasa alikuwa from the second wife sasa so, wakati tumeenda ku, kujenga huko hivyo nimefikisha budangu pale mta msefa mtu mnaona katoka tu huko tu hapana no it's no it's not uh, it's unacceptable akatoa tu hizo mavitu zetu afa kujengea hapa kalia hii shamba tuwezi jenga bwana eh mwanze pale hivyo kwa kumenuka shonde mtu wangu akakuja hadi na mapolisi bwana eh hako na right right of the of the land sijui nini 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 so nyinyi na mlikuwa wezi hiyo time tulikuwa wezi bwana lakini ocha squeeze so hiyo shamba hapana so hiyo na politician so inajua mko same page hapana Ili, ilikuwa zile vitu fulani zile arguments za siblings una get ni mnyesa mmoja kwa na evidence mingi mwingine ana evidence za mlikuwa na kifua eh mwingine amefika tu ocha hiyo na sit 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 down za kuuza shamba za ocha wananifukuzanga mimi ni mtoto aje wewe unauzanga shamba nikawa nauza njugu <laughs> aje sasa kuna wazee tu kadhaa wamekaa hapo kazi yao ni watakula kila mtu kama elfu moja moja mm. kazi yao ni ku sign hizo papers kuonyesha hao ndio wali witness hiyo shamba ikiuzwa mm. sasa so, wametulia hapo round mna discuss hapo mna bonga kuhusu shamba anakuambia miguu 10 sijui miguu 11 
e, mpaka unaanza kumwambia unaona hii shamba iko karibu na Napier grass chini kuna mto kando siji kuna nini mtu anajiuza sera pale ukipata mzee amejisukuma wallahi eh ni kama biashara ya ngombe sio unavyo ngombe zuzu sasa wewe kama mkono hivi leta mkono kisho nimeleta eh au pia mimi nimeweka hivi sasa sasa umeweka hivi so tuna agree eh hii ngombe ni 24000 ah hapana bwana 24000 hapana ah nipe 2350 nataka 51 eh ndugu yangu Mm. Abu menigonga kabisa. Tutane katikati nipatie 45. Eh ndugu yangu wanaachilia tena. Sasa wanafanyaje hivi? Nasikia kitu nilia. Eh hiyo ndo umeamini huyu bwana kufanya ushi. Eh wallahi. Ushi ni akalt na pimo. Wallahi anapeleka shaka holes. Bombo bombo. Shaka holes nini? Kuna application fly inaitwa Twitter ndugu yangu. Watu wanaingia ngo kwa kusema shida zao. Ushaingia uko kwa na shida za watu. Naambia watu wana mashida hii dunia. Kuna kijana ameenda pale kulia akasema kuna dema alimwaribu kichwa hadi akaenda ushago wa kunu dema kapata hawana stima. <laughs> <laughs> akapata kume oh my love kwa kumbe wananga stima. Anang'a Nairobi na nyumbani ni giza tupu. And he felt for her parents. Yes. Akavuruta stima 5 kilometers. <laughs> Sasa kidogo unajua. Azote nikushu. Shoshangu alikuwa anavuta stima ilikuwa like some distance kulikuwa na main road la Lafsa sisi tuko mahali ndani ndani. Huko Nax kuna tu mzee wa nyama. Kuweka ilikuwa yake tu pole moja. Msee shosha alipo domingi. As in so ukiniambia kusema 5 kilometers, umsa litoboka. Alivuta stima 5? 5 kilometers. Jo anaurumia the love, unaona? Mhm. Lakini sahi hawako pamoja ndugu yangu aliachwa. Naenda kwa nauliza afanye nini? Unajonga ile ngombe ile ngoma ya wakadinali? Msama <laughs> sana ngombe. I wish ningekuwa KPLC. <laughs> Monti unajua hiyo ngoma. Gani? Ile ya uh, Kiyama muwe na nakamba za nguo. I wish ningekuwa ninge KPLC. Ningetoka na kamba zangu pale ungenipata. Ungen hizo si zako, hizo za KPLC. Sinilipa. Ndio maana ni wishes, hazizi kwa kweli. Sema sinilipa. Utaenda wangusha miti ya stima. Naomba power so nataka kupanda pale alafu hizo waya nichukue nene niuze kama kopa. Ndugu yangu utaangusha miti ya stima. No. Unajua ni kampuni ya Ruto. <laughs> Wewe unasema nini? Wewe utajua mimi ni waja. Unaangusha kampuni ya waja. Umeme. Waja ya umeme sasa. Lakini tumsaidie tu kweli. Ndugu mm. yangu afanye nini? Unajua stima 5 kilometers alafu mkaachana. Kuna Your love was electric. Kuna vitu zingine. <laughs> <laughs> It was parking. <laughs> kuna kuna vitu zingine ukisha duni hivyo. Una A- get? Hapana. As in kuna vitu zingine zina come back down to agree to. Yo, as tuwa... in for example, ulishapeleka mdem kempiski siju kama introduce kwa nani kwa nani, uwezi reverse. Una Monti, get? Yo, as in ibes ibes umeka stima for example kana umeka stima, uh, hata kutoa stima from the word go ulishaweka stima. So hakuna nyinyi naona semetisha hudi, ulina kadasta. As in acha tu iende. Si mimi naitisha tu my token of joy. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Uyo kijana vile mlikataa kumsaidia. Mwanzake mm. alimwambia kumbe ndugu yangu wewe una shida. Mi niko na shida. Mm-hmm. Kuna mwingine sasa aliambiwa na mwanzi yake she is pregnant. Uh-huh. Saka take care of the pregnancy. Kuanzia mm. the first month hadi the ninth month. Yes. Akishughulikia cravings, anataka sio harufu ya dust ya jirani yeye unanusishwa. Mm. Yeye anataka sio baji ya Arsenal yeye si the trophy. Ndio hiyo hajashinda. Miguza punda. <laughs> Jio makofi ya Jose Mourinho azina una msichana tu ni wazimu tunataka vitu weird mm-hmm. saa tisa usiku anataka zima magoti ya punda ndatoa wapi lakini ukijana alikuwa anajituma mpaka uh-huh. hiyo siku akasema will you be in the delivery room akasema yes mama my love mama angu dogo yangu si mtoto alitoka ni muindi Mtoto alitoka muindi ndugu yangu. Ni kijana, huyu kijana si atipia ni muindi. Ni kijana kama mimi. Mm. Na ako na msichana kama mimi tu, rangi yangu. Mm-hmm. Lakini afuta kushughulika yote. Mimi kama ni wode. Mtoto alitoka ako tu huko ndani. Na kataa tu, na kataa <laughs> kata, kata tu ni wako. Mimi kama ni wode na kataa tu. Is the food that I've been eating. Is the food. <laughs> Check your family maybe well, maybe your uncle yeah kwanza nikipata ikipata wakati wa craving zako wako kwa nakuletea vitu zenye wewe unataka unalia tu is what you gave me the stones you remember the white stones ama umo umo adam ni waitress kwa indian restaurant umbo matako chafu ah. sasa huyu kijana afanye nini ah dante frank mm. uko delivery ni mtoto ametoka ni muindi unafanya nini hii ndio chance yangu mpya kutafuta visa jamani ende tu huko usikie patel mambo <laughs> 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 movie ya kwanza unafaa kufanya ni kufika 
kufika kwa law enforcers juu un, i, unajua kama kama ulikuwa kwa delivery room inamaanisha ulisena the certificate birth certificate inamaanisha uh, unaweza kuwa si biological father but mbele ya mbele ya law you are the father na get mm. eh, like law ikicheki itaangalia ati oh kuna baba muindi no itachekiwa ndo the biological father so hivyo mtoto muindi lakini at lo- ah, ah, jamani ah, aitambui serikali ya muoni huni muindi serikali itambui amuoni tu ni muindi mimi nakaa tuoni mtoto ni muindi serikali itaangalia the accumulation of events vinye zimekuwa mm. wewe ndo umekuwa sasa birth certificate naweka umondi rajesh wewe ndo umekuwa wewe ulisend kwa birth certificate tukaandika umondi mimi ndo baba ya huyu muindi mm. change patel wa fula <laughs> rikshna shida iko wapi rikshna uh, mimi naitwa sikra sik- sik- <laughs> umondi lakini ni, ni noma uh. ni noma unaweza lia eh hey. Sasa sasa hivi for example kiza jituma deadly alafu pate hiyo mimba umekuwa kiwako jamani hiyo bidii si yako ndugu yangu kwanza hiyo siku yenye umempeleka ku deliver huo huo mto, baba mtoto sasa anakuja jamaa fulani mkubwa na heshima zake na amepack wewe oh, unatoka huko na kapepa bag yako ndani umeweka ndizi mbili na ma- alafu nimebeba carrots flower na kwa hiyo 200 hiyo hiyo kesi inaka kwa serious juu kuna kesi kai zika dhazi chaifanyika unapata mse alipata mtoi alafu walipata mtoi na the partner alafu aka discover the whole time mtoi si wake mm. but wakiishia kwa court yakaenda kugo against vitu kai hizi unapata kumbe kumbe nini bibi yako ni mjanja alicheza kai yeye alienda hapo hivyo akaita judge kando akafinyia judge akaenda sijui nani kando akamfinyia yake akamfinyia yake so kesi ki come out by the end of the day unapata alikuwa amechekiwe pay yake iko mahali so wewe unaweza unaweza satisfy mtoto ikifika vitu za financial na vitu kai zote so unapata kuna msiflana na gharama kama hali but the whole time to isi wake unapata jua ligeuziwa huyu mm. msali huyu madam anaenda kalipa daktari daktari irada ambie msi mtoto ni wake history ishe kabla umalize ile ya king kaka inakuanga aje jusi ile wangi watoto wako wanafaa mbochi unajua when people stay together for so long they tend to look together unaona hata mimi na Trevor unaona ndugu yangu sio kanikosea heshima wewe don't don't ever dare wewe unadhani unatamani kunaona mashavu hivyo sure na kama matako ya mtoto impasu lakini hiyo story nakupata kuna story nyingine nilisikia ya mdem fulani so alipata unaona hii wanafanyanga vasectomy eh ya god hii nataka kujaribu nataka kupiga hiki kitu nataka nikuwe naingia tu eh bila kama kuleze vasectomy kishafanyika mse amwage ama nini sina sikia amekata siju tube ya sperms so sperms hazitoki eh, ju nilisikia hadi ati kuna iza kuna sperms zilibaki kwa 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 mrija so wakati tunapiga unazapata mtoto unapewa pia time kuna span ya time ndauliza bien <laughs> bien amefanya vasectomy mm. bro sasa bien... ndio maana chiki yako anataka ule msana mdansie bwana bien amefanya <laughs> Siju si kama hajafanya alisema anaweza fanya. Ah kufanya alisema anaweza fanya. Mm. Okay 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 he's down for it. You yes. for reason mbona anaimba vizuri. <laughs> eh. Amefinywa gadi. Amefinywa guado. <laughs> Lakini ukinywa guado unatonga soprano. <laughs> eh unaweza unaweza toa soprano. <laughs> Na too easy. Shida, shida kai sasa ukienda kwa polisi unaweza saidia. Umeenda kwa polisi tu umeenda kuzalisha mtoto ukapata mtoto akufanani. Sijai ona kesi kama hiyo lakini kwa sio kuna dramatic tu kuna mtu tu ameenda tu na akakwama. Kenya huwezi lakini nchi za ngambo zina unaweza. Yeah. Eh. Kenya naangalia nga as in Kenya hata ukienda nga na hizi stories za domestic violence kwa police station kama mwanaume ukizaenda useme eti yeye bibi yangu amenichapa hasa watakuchekelea kama afala. Toka toka hapa. Angalia huyu. <laughs> chapa. Ndakuchapa. Mwanamke anakuchapa. Unachapa wewe na mwanamke bwana. Mwanamke. Wewe ni mwanamke. Which, which brings me to the question mna feel that we trust our law enforcers akina ma police akina JGSU KDF mna feel ni ju, yes kuna yo, kuna yo aspect ya yes they are humans but even when they they've been given a level of power do you think tunezawa tunezawa amin tunezawa amin passe me i guess tuko kwa revolution bado bado atuko position tunaweza sema 100% tunaweza kia life zetu kwa lain tukiamini ase wako na best interest zetu at heart number one jumi ni shay kama ni shay ni shay shiko na makarao mara kadhaa ni shay kwa kwa kesi hata ya stroke true kushikwa not less than six months so umekuwa mwizi na huyu unafanya nini huyu unafanya nini huyu mse unafanya nini 
Sasa ni kupigia story ama wewe ndugu yako. Ulishikwa na kesi ya structure tulifanya nini? Hiyo sasa ni robbery with violence. <laughs> Ulienda kuiba? Baba. Bala. Bala. Ulienda kuiba? Sasa ndugu yangu. Sikuwa na kuiba. So ilikuwa hivi kuna tenje fulani nilijengwa. Sasa hii tenje mi nili nili buy second hand nikijua hii tenje acha nipigie shughuli before nirudi chuo. Actually nilikuwa high school hizo time. Mm-hmm. So tulikuwa tunakaribia kurudi chuo. So hiyo time fulani nika nilikuwa tu nimetulia mtaani. Sasa nikachukua hii tenje nikaanza kutumia tumia. Mimi sikuwa nangangana. Kumbe hii tenje all this time inakuwa inakuwa tracked na kutoka police station. Okay. So every time na make a call Nasikia kiniambia eh hey, inaniambia welcome to Kenya Police Service. Nashindwa. <laughs> Kwani ni niko na mtu nataka pale police. <laughs> Shetani ameshikwa. <laughs> ameshikwa. Hizi kaiba katoka basi kashikwa. Eh. Sasa kila time inaenda hivyo. Alafu walitumia kadi different kunikamata. So kuna time walitumia msichana. Kasema hizo siku nilikuwa na chat sana. Wum sana kaanza kuniambia wewe oh, I'm around your area where are you I need to see you sijui nini hizo siku mmm polisi yako na content hivi mmm ana ma polisi bado bwana nilikuwa hiyo ni hapa Kenya mimi naongelea hapa Kenya huyu ameona movie mingi si ndio niko serious kabisa sasa wakatuma msichana sasa mimi nikaenda kuona huyo mdemo wakanitumia undercover ah kijana alishikwa jua kohoni mmm Dugu yangu Frank huyu kijana alishikwa juu ya hodi Mboro Mboro ilinipeleka jela Mboro ilinipeleka jela ndugu zangu Ukaenda sasa kumit na demo Sasa nikaenda kumit na wewe demo ndugu yangu After nilifika tu hivi mali wewe demo alikuwa nikamhagi hivi part Unajua hiyo kwanza ilikuwa incident ya pili ya kwanza walini track down alafu nikiwa mahali niko na mahali masanse wanaenda wengi nikasema ah acha ni change direction Juu time yenye nili, nilifika saa police station walikuwa wampiga story venye waliniekea mtego ya kwanza yenye nikahepa. Okay. Sasa so, hii ya pili yenye walitumia umdem, time tu nilihaga umdem na kuambia walitokea masanse kama 15. Mwingine amenishika hapa, mwingine huku nyuma, mwingine hapa, makende ndio hizo zimefura hapa ndogo. Na mdogo tu hivyo kashikwa na watu wengi. Jamani mtu mmoja. Kwani wakupewa picha yako? Ndio nashindwa. <laughs> Ama picha ile pani haita wakupewa. Eh. Ndugu yangu nikaingia pale nje, nikaingia kwanza cell pale Kariobangi, nitonga Kariobangi North Police Station ndugu yangu. Ndio police station kambiwa kijana tutakuua hey. tutakuua hii simu ilipotea ikiwa na 20000 Kenyan shilling ilikuwa 20 hapana walisema pesa mingi walisema kama 100k hivi mama yangu tu kwanza mali alikuwa tu anakuja kinyamba na leso akifunga wasi wasi memipiga bibi ya Daudi sasa apumui mtoto wake nyota nyota yake inazima nyota ya familia Yaani nikafika pale police station kwanza hiyo simu siku ana alikuwa anatumia nyingine wakaniambia tu kwanza hiyo simu iko wapi sasa police wote kwa police station nzima wamekuja kwa hiyo cell ndogo wamenishanitoa kiatu wamenambia nitoe shati wametoa ma, magun wameka hapo kwa meza tutakushoot wewe tutakupeleka Dandora Damsite wewe tutakumaliza leo lazima ukufe kwa wapi wa marafiki zako hii simu ilipotea na 100000 sasa leta simu na ulete 100000 ndugu yangu nishaiona 100000 kumbe mko na huyu wase weka lawama tjio system yetu ya law enforcers ama system yetu ya ku ya ku ya ku keep to law and order basically sama to the police the, the police like uh. wase upenda kutata venye wako on point but nikisia story kama yako ina maana number one kwa msalipeleka complaint number two aka follow up to the complaint juu hadi ndo wachukue mdem wa ku track na mdem hadi wa kupele wa fike bezo na pana mdem una mhag na unatokea uh. ina maana they, they were really invested in it okay? uh-huh. So mimi feel to some extent yes wase we kalawama at you uh, atuzi trust e system atuzi trust ah wase but ni wase wanaekelea kazi lakini ni, ni, ni angoli yetu ndio different now lakini kwa kesi kumi, tuseme kesi moja ndio ilifanywa hivyo na namba one ni juu kulikuwa na mse kuna wase mse alicomplain a lot na kulikuwa na mse alikuwa na support hiyo story naona kama ile story tulisikia ya DJ Fatso na ule kijana na get Walianza ku investigate hiyo story temenye Samido anaanza kuongelelea wase online wameanza kuongelelea ndio inaanza kuwa story big sasa okay. but 
kawaida before hata huo mtu hii sijui aziko ama nini hakuna msaliko haiku kwa ime kwa hivyo meja haiku ime trackiwa tension yenye inahitaji on a normal day kiamburu watu wanafaa kuwa ku busy as in case ime happen mtu amepoteza simu wapi tuanze ku track Kenya hata saa yuko zapoteza simu yako enda police station utapatua bi namba na hakuna kitu kingine ita happen okay lakini ile time flani ile scandal ya pale survey time watu walikuwa wanapoteza ma simu wa kidunga visu wali try Mm. Ni cheki wale rudisha masimu mobo akambia aseka ulipoteza simu ende. Mm. Ni cheki wale pigadi picha mko cheki zilikuwa ma iPhone. Ni cheki ni cheki ma iPhone kadhaa zilipatikana sijui kasarani. Oh eh ni cheki ni cheki. Eh inamaanisha kwa hii kwa, kwa hii kitu ya police kuna setu tu miakili vizuri lakini majority labda ndio kidogo ana upungufu. <laughs> eh jumi polisi 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 na unanga polisi ni mzuri kama ni rafiki yangu. Upungufu. Jumi mara mingi hii ni kiguru karibu bangi nimekuwa nikikimbia polisi azina hata sina makosa lakini na feel tunaweza shikwa. Na, na feel kitu kitu nye system yetu inafaa ku adjust azina za country ni kungoja hype una, una get. Juu kama hiyo story uliko nasema hiyo ya hapo survey ni juu ni more than a story. Ni kuna msi mmoja alikomplain mwingine akakomplain mwingine akakomplain ndio ikakuwa ni big issue. Na feel ikikuwa broken down into details ikuwe Azim Sefana ameteta mahali kuna ishuka hii. Mm. Each issue inafaa kuwa taken very seriously na ikuwe na investigation, ikuwe na vitu kadhaa zina add up onto it. Ju mm. mara mingi ukiishia na issue yenye ijakuwa ki hit the headlines, mara mingi utatakiwa seriously because uh-huh. mimi kwa time fulani nilishaibiwa nilisha kwangu. Nilibiwa mavitu kadhaa nilibiwa la PTV, sijui nini, mavitu kadhaa zili, zilibebo. Mm. So ju anyway kitu ilikuwa imeshafanyika na sikuwa na hiyo as in nishatokwa unanipata sasa ni kwa nataka tu nifike tu kwa police station niandikishe tu report at least unanipata so mimi nika make my way pale hivyo kasarani police station nikafika hapo hivyo nikamwambia eh naishi hii place na hii place iko around hii area yenu juu unajua kila police station kuna area ina cover so nikamwambia iko around hii area yenu na na ni around kasarani constituency na mimi nilitokwa so kuambia story as in i i was taken with all that way to get ni ebu ebu ngoja pale wewe kuja wewe kuja unapata so by the end of the day when nilikuwa na nilikuwa napiga sabu either ni ngoja hapa hivi niendelee na hii story niandikishe hiyo nipate si juu obinama na bla 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 nikafadhalisha kuishia una get juu nilikuwa na feel anyway nikipeana ni diangu ilikuwa tu nifikishe hii ripoti juu nilikuwa na feel nikipeana hii ripoti anyway kwa kitu kitafanyika unapata so mimi ni kama one step ni kama one ishie juu nilikuwa na feel as in po, mostly system yetu hata si police system peke yake like in general our government system you when on a hype as in w- wapi wasi wame complain sana as in kama kama kuna wasi wasi kama 50 wame complain kuhusu base flani ndio base napewa attention as in wana, hezi, pewa, wana, hezi pewa attention na na, na the goji, first wanangoja trend eh, wanangoja kuwe serious hata ukiangalia tu conversation yenye wewe unaweza have na police on a normal level design yenye si eti ni brother yako huko police ni brother yako ama ni cousin yako mm. design yenye ni police na wewe mnaongea okay. as in hata venye ana ku approach tu mkiongea already ana, ana ku dominate na kuonyesha mimi niko above the law mimi naweza kupanga by true, the way mimi niko na uniform na niko na bunduki naweza kurarua wewe na hiyo mashavu zako naona naweza kulipua hiyo kichwa tulikuwa na ile siku fulani tulishikwa si ndio shishiko na wewe acha kwanza nirudi oh, unaniharibia sifa <laughs> Anaribia sifa huko kijana. Sina kwanza sina yangu na polisi ni. Kwanza hata recruitment tu ya polisi jamani. Venye wana recruit. Mbona unaangalia mtu kama ako na meno 32 na mbili ni yakuuma mwizi? 32 teeth. Meno inakuanga mzuri ukikuwa na zote. <laughs> <laughs> unajua ukiwa kwa vita unafunganga mdomo. Inasaidia kushikilia akili. Eh ukiwa kwa vita unajua kufunga mdomo. Ukifunga kaa kuna kagap. Mm. Utapata utashtuka sasa <laughs> imeno ya chini itaitoa gap ikuue unaona kwa maana hey, unaona pia ka una mwanya <laughs> una meno mnakimbia kwa vita upepo inapiga <laughs> una uso <laughs> enemy wanajua ndio huyu made the suits rain na pigo umejivia lakini so lazima uko na meno zote lazima uko na meno zote jumi na, na feeling wase wengi hata gavai angali yangi kama mse yako mentally stable ku take job juna mbwani nafaa kuwa hivyo unafaa kuwa kama wewe ni police unapenda hii job as in unataka kufanya unataka kuserve wase Unataka ku maintain law and order, unataka ku make sure wasi wako poa. Sisi tunafanya for survival. Uwezi yeka life ya mse, unajua mse ampoa gun, inakonga polisi mmoja wasi wangapi kama so mbili 237. For one police ana cover, anafa protect wasi kama mse ako mentally unstable na umempea bunduki kona research, hata tutarua hata tuua huyu. 
Eh. Eh hata hata tu polisi mwingine alirua mtu marisasi. Ah ilikuwa video ya Uganda. Ilikuwa Kenya. Eh ilikuwa Uganda. Uganda. Eh. Hapo tuna gun black kwa hivyo akamchapa tu marisasi na shanga. Eh. Alipewa alipewa siju ya negative paycheck or something. So akajama all of a sudden akakoko AK47 yake akamimina marisasi. Kupewa ndo wazimu kazi. Eh Kenya sije hiyo na polisi yako na tatu. Hivi tu imejaa vizuri hivi. Ndako kwa na tatu. Si ndio, azini nini? Nini ina sasa tatu inazuia wewe kushika mwizi? Sasa no maana si necessary. Ah ah utapata wasio kienda recruitment. Umse anaweza kimbia, umse anapenda hii job, umse anataka kufanya hii job. Lakini anaweza nyimo hiyo opportunity ako na tatu kwa shingo. Si okay. ushaiona polisi ako na tatu kwa shingo Kenya. Mimi sijawahi ona. Mimi nataka mwenye kuna piercing. Eh? Kwa mapua. Nataka kwa recruit mtu akona piercing kwa mapua hapa na kuja niambie ni afande. Ningoa tu niwaambie bitch. Lakini tukiangalia hata hizi video za mapolisi za countries zingine kama ukicheki wase wako US, wase wako Asia, ukiangalia hata gari wanatumbia, wakifanya hizo TikTok videos. Ukiangalia unaona eh wapi anaweza nishika? Nishike ba. Kenya nikaona natafutanga tu mtu anataka venye hata wajali bora tu ni polisi anaweza beba pingu wanamchukua tu kuja. Shida na kwanga nayo na polisi wa Kenya. Yo land cruiser ukiniambia tu nipane ndo pana ndugu yangu. Unaona? <laughs> Yo land cruiser mkufungua hiyo mlango nda panda. Already mko wengi. <laughs> mko kama 15 mmeniambia ni acheni nipande. Unaona? Wana feel mtaji help. <laughs> Sijakata sina upungufu. Wacha nipande land cruiser. Dakika kidogo ushaniinua umenirusha uona naweza panda. Polisi ashe ni shika ni kafil gay. Alinua lonyo yangu ngotha nilikuwa navanga sambusa ikapita hapa katikati ya kundu jamani ikiwa moto ikararua hivi eh polisi naomba msaada msamee <laughs> which brings me to una feel tukiweza improve work ethic ya mapolisi wetu law enforcement inaweza kuwa ona level yenye ni fit kwa wase kwa sababu na kama 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 venye majuu si ucheke either kwa movies ama pia kwa reality shows whatever wacheki polisi anaambia msee put your hands up uh, put your body against the wall whatever you say oh, will be used kuna, against you the court of law yeah. yeah, like iku agi tu ati abruptly tu umeshikwa hapa ngothe ko juice tu ni booty jais wamesha kwa kifua yako tu vizuri nilikula kofi <laughs> nilikula kofi nikiwa na yeye kuna siku tumeshikwa nimekula kofi moto <laughs> na unapigwa ngo <laughs> wali wali ni labua unapigwa ngo kofi unaambiwa unauliza swali na ujibu ukijibu tu unapigwa unaongea unashangaa <laughs> polisi alafu wote wanakuwa na accent same kitana unaenda wapi unatoka wapi can you talk can you talk when you to mzima can you talk mke <laughs> na feel polisi wote wakaza improve waketi yao vitu zinaweza kuwa better number one mimi na feel gava ina, inafaa kwanza ku treat polisi better ju wasi ukam job wakiwa tuna hasira za ju most of the time polisi anatafuta any means and as a mind do kwako na get okay. as inataki kujua problem ilikuwa gani hataki kujua direction ya hiyo situation inakaaje okay. yeye anaangalia tu anaezaje tu adoo kwako kwa hii situation yenye tuko kama sasa hii okay. ukikuta na kaa traffic police mm. hataki kujua hii gari itaua msi ujaangalia gari linaenda check ujaangalia brakes iko sawa bora msi acha kufinyia kichoko kitu wako kwa mfuko unjali hata hiyo gari kai mbeba anti yako ama mama yako ama nani wako wewe mm. unachilia tu yende Okay. Apo ume risk life ya msi as in wewe ujali kuhusu situation ya msi wewe bora wewe umeshiba wewe uko fresh au ujali unakumbuka ile siku nilibambwa na ule polisi mpaka anaomba jamani nimpe kitu wa kunywa jamani nikasema <laughs> polisi ampewe kitu jamani hey, wanafaa waanze kulishwa vizuri wa kule yeah. vizuri itapunguza, itapunguza corruption by the way mm. waki improve life zao definite actually ni kila mtu tu yeah. uki improve life yako na standard of living utapata Wezi acha makosa ya slide at jamii mbili. Mm. Jusa hizi na check out the the people in blue. Mm. Naona their their salaries mm. na check venye wana earn. Ya Kenya police. Yeah, na ya Kenya police. Hey, Niambie kuna mkangu fulani polisi. Wallahi unatakuja kana za kutolea form. Ya shikangi simu zangu. <laughs> you like kulingana ranks uh the the superior the the super in intendant. Superintendent superintendent mwenyewe mm. the superintendent anapata 73000 mm. na tu chibo piju ya kula chinga masunuke mdomo 73000 only mm. alafu next assistant wake anafuata nyuma na 1570 530 that so, is 73000 so mwenye kujua kabisa ni 73000 chini yake ni 70 mm. alafu kuna mwingine anaitwa <laughs> chief inspector huyu kimwana anakuanga na nyota hapa kwa bega jamani mm. anakula 59220 makofi kwake huyo sasa kuna inspector of police huyu anakulanga 
Unajua serikali nampenda huyu unajua anasaidia sana. Anakula 53820 makofi kwake. Hiyo pesa ni mingi. Pesa ni mingi sana. Na si ndio mbona hata anakula hiyo pesa yote. Hiyo okay, okay. ni some of watu wenye wanapokea du kama mtu kama senior sergeant okay. yeye anakula 50k senior sergeant anakula 50000 eh, okay. sergeant anakula 45k 540 uh-huh. alafu kuna corporal huyo anakulanga 42000 hiyo pesa kwanza tumemspoil huyo alafu kuna eh hey, anakula 42 si huko wa makop anakuwa gana ro sasa kuna gazeti, kuna constable huyu ni fresh graduate huyu ametoka pale ame Kiganjo. mapema ameshika biblia akasema na hapa e eh, bro aonde <laughs> wale mapolisi huku shika hapa akikupata na jaba unajua mm. baada ya excited <laughs> ana feel ni illegal mm. akutu excited tu umevaa miwani usiku anakukamata kuja hapa unajifanya msanii usiku eh usimuone hivyo mshahara wake ni 32880 wana kama hizo na mshahara zao na feed wacha tu wakule hongo eh. mm. na 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 sijui kama una feel ni kama wakiongezwa waki mshahara inaweza punguza corruption si same at police tuna wanafanya corruption hapana okay wacha nifanye hivi basi mm. waki improve living standards zetu una feel corruption ita reduce ita reduce ju kila mtu utaka was kila mtu utaka life yake ikuwe better kila time so kila opportunity unapata una grab lakini kama life yako unajua tunakuwa na shida za kimaskini okay ujakula una rent mtoto amefukuzwa fees as in shida za kimaskini tu na last bona amekojwa kwa kape manze vitu za upuzi tu oh, nyoka ilingia kwa kiatu as in vitu azizisaidia kabisa hospitali vitu kama hizo ukipata design yenye kama gava mimi na kwa gana NHIF unajua kama wewe umeandikwa kazi kama sisi ndio kwa ndio ni TF ene TF kendo hospitalini jamani ni kama takriban shilingi 800 pekee yake ndugu yangu nadanganya ama ni 1500 yenye ene TF ina cater for ni ni ina cater it for everything ina depend na penye umeenda pia ina uh. depend na hapo penye upenyumeishia for example kama ukienda Kenyatta uh. unapata yes inaweza cater for many things but only some surgeries una get kuna surgeries nyingine zina bid you do it kwa mfuko yako mm. na ukishia kwa in the private hospitals mm. mara mingi ukieta for the bed unajua kuna kwa hiyo okay. kama kama msema lazo usiku na hiyo bed charges za every day mm-hmm. unapata mara mingi na kieta for bed peke yake ama kieta for anything extra ni kitu kama maybe some painkillers medication blah 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 mm. like i get for everything eh yeah. yeah. so ukiangalia okay, vitu kama hizo design yenyewe police yako na NHIF lakini aiezi msaidia pia yeye. Okay, okay, okay. As in yeye malipo akikutana na wewe tu sahi unanuka bangi, uwezi mconvince hata kama una bangi, utatoa hiyo bangi. Ndakupiga wewe bila tao mbili na uwezi mconvince. Hata wewe uwezi. Okay, okay. Unapata. So mm. ukipata hizi shida za kimaskini, ukipata design yenye kama mtu wa polisi anaweza chuo for free, primary, high school mpaka uni. As in hiyo shida hakuna already. Mm-hmm. As in umse anafanya hii job genuinely, as in from the heart anataka tu kuwa polisi, asaidie wananchi waishi mm. fit. Okay. Yeah. Ina in in make sense na, na feel kama ni kitu inaweza inaweza reduce corruption. Mm. Siji kama na feel the same way. Juu mara mingi mara mingi kuna hadi time kuko barabara ama time una move about uko Kenya unapata hujasema uh, where and about where uh, and about yeah. <laughs> unapata kusa zingine polisi anakuwa na but unamwangalia unasema inayo ni njaa hadi hey. ukimwangalia unasema kuna kuna deal yako fulani jaivana mahali uh-huh. juu ju, unapata saa zingine hiyo 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 ngori umeshikwa nayo ni ngori ya domingi una get uh-huh. but huyo bongo ako willing ako willing umpe maybe hiyo ngori hiyo hiyo ngori ni 50k una get uh-huh. Yo the the offense you may commit uh. 50k but una pata police ya ready at umpeta 25000 umpe am uh. umpeta 2000 umpeta 1000 mm. your offense big ina maanisha in the real sense siat ni yes yes kuna hiyo factor ya eh, maisha ni ngumu uh. but u police do anajengwa si do ina satisfy si do si do anaza keep everything in check una get mimi naweza ukisema hivyo naweza kumbuka several stories zenye zime hit headlines zenye ulisikia polisi ali ali loan out gani yake kwa mategi waende okay, wafanye okay, nao shughuli okay. get mm. design yenye as in wewe uko at line kabisa design yenye hata okay yeye ni mo mm-hmm. kitu yenye as in wameku tumeku entrust na lives zetu tukakupia gun mm-hmm. lakini unapatiana to the wrong people wa okay. kuja wahamu wase eh eh na wewe tunakuaminia eh as in wewe ni msetu natarajia kabisa wewe ndio unafaa to protect lakini ume, ume neglect hiyo mandate hata ikuhusu kabisa 
umepeana gani yako una get inamaanisha umse hata kwa life yake yani yeye mali imefika hata imuhusu kabisa Trevor unaweza kufa ama una hata kulikuwa na story yenye kulikuwa na mapolisi wanaenda kuibia wase usiku eh yeah, she is a story mchana ni polisi John ni take mm. Jesus ni mi, na hii ni inakuja hapo kwa training hakuna training hii kunaangalia meno polisi ni muoga <laughs> ananishika nikisimama tu niangalie kwa macho anaogopa <laughs> nani jamani <Yaman>, nani <laughs> taka mtu akijama mejama usikuje unakaa hafifu ndugu yangu mimi squeeze mta yenye naishi kuna kuanga na tulika store kuna tulika store tudogo tudogo hapo kuna time nimeshtuka tu nikashangaa kwa ni polisi wamekuwa kanjo ama nini huo happen mm. ase daily on a daily ni waona wakitembea kwa hizo liquor store nikaenda nikauliza huyo msesi siku moja ase ufanya nini hapo kuja kuwa chunga wana make sure pombe imwagiki ama nini <laughs> ama wana wisha una drink responsible unajua <laughs> <Mujo, laughs> yeah. utumishi kote unajua yeah. huduma bora ya mtuko kukusaidia wana utumishi kote jamani mm. akaniambia kila polisi ukama hapo kila mtu kamia share yake ya pombe eh? <laughs> share of gani wanafanya biashara pamoja kitu kake kwa mfuko tu kulinda tu polisi unajua polisi pia anahitaji mlindo unaweza dhani kuna bunduki naweza jilinda hapana anahitaji 200 100 ya mtu kuchukua do eh na umeifanya routine design yenyewe una daily unakaa kuchukua ujue ni sansi eh eh mm. nilio nimeona hiyo as in nilikuwa na nilikuwa iga kujua nikaenda kuuliza ase kwa hiyo likasto iko hapo mtaani na ukikata sijui wana kufungia biz sasa Sijui sijui nini wapi na after hapo. Eh hey, hiyo hiyo ni ngori. Niliona pia makanjo na upuzi fulani ya kuangusha maviba, mavibanda za watu. Eh hey, niliona. Wanadondisha vibanda as insuniambie tu nitoke nifanye biashara hapa. Mbona unaangusha vibanda? Eh hey, walipigenisha vitu chini pale Westland siku amene. Mi actually ngori yangu na hizo story kama za kanjo kuangusha vibanda za wasee yuko moja. As in mara mingi unapata kanjo au take do fulani kutoka kwa wasee every now and then sijeti ata sijeti atafanywa nini na sainiwa pa university flani mm. so ina maanisha by the end of the day government dojo kanjo ni gava uh-huh. in any place una touch na any government official na maanisha una deal na gava una okay. uh-huh. so ina maanisha it time yenye walikuwa na wana have hii conversation ya kadu flani kana kana toka uh-huh. ina maanisha huyu msee anajua anajua kuna ndio imetoka ina maanisha gava inajua kuna ndio imetoka uh-huh. so si leo time yenye nafika ati kuna kwa nangori time mnakuja kuangusha vibanda zao si ama sijum na kimbiza mnakimbiza mahoka uko tao na time yote kuna dom nachukua kwa wao see acha ni kwanza as long as kuna dom nachukuliwa akufai kuona situation ka hiyo inafai kuwe governor acknowledge kuna busy yako hapa na you since wana take wana take any type of tax from your busy yako na maanisha busy yako inafai kuwe inafai kuwe valid monti na sijui kama ni true lakini kuna possible way yenye polisi utumika kama puppets okay as in behind activities za polisi kuna mse mwenye ana control what is supposed to happen the big puppet kuna 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 ule mse yako pale juu sasa ana dancesha ama mafala okay. ukiangalia most of the time unaona hata time kuna kuanga na demonstration ama nini unaweza pata tu masanse wetu tu mahali kuna kisimu moja itaingia hivi kutakuwa na mbwembwe zingine pale tutapigwa magoti hawataki kujua ulikuwa haukukua unajua unakumbuka ile siku tulibambwa pale ile sehemu yetu siku ya birthday yangu ile siku mm. enye hawa sie ni hawa walituanza uchokozi na wakatupiga ala <laughs> daga <laughs> 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 atulia walituanza uchokozi uongo Yao. Polisi mgani alikuanza uchokozi uongo ndugu polisi, yangu? Polisi aliitwa baadaye. Uongo. Mtu utapiga story man. Adini yao alituanza uchokozi. <laughs> ndugu yangu unataka kudanganya. Unadanganyishia afande. Afande aliitwa. Okay, okay. okay. inaweza kuwa msee alianza uchokozi but unajua kama polisi ukipull up place flani. Polisi by the way ni ni car leaders unapata. For example wameingia club Trevor na pigana na calligraph. Wasingi wana niuliwa na meniua. Nilikuwa nataka kusema kali polisi anaitwa nini? Polisi akifika anafaka kwanza uulize eh what's going on? Umse amevuta tatu yako moja ama nini mbaya? Hapana jafuta tatu yangu moja. Eh Trevor, calligraph amekuuma. 
hapana kalika faji fanya ali shima juna ni wakayole <laughs> unapata like mm. na feel police ikuja kwa any situation anafa mm. akuje ku neutralize akuje as in ye, ye the the leadership the arm of leadership yenye naingia mm. kwa kwa huyo normal mwananchi but in this case of me and dante kulikuwa na but they are dante sasa so, tumeenda bezfani pale hivyo tikaro tumeselebrate deadly tukasema ah sasa situfike nyumbani unajua wakati tunapiga vitu moja mbili tatu <laughs> nini nini Inatoka cough syrup mvinyo wakati umepiga vitu moja mbili tatu kuna venye unakoga hyped mm. una get you uko tu na furaha una, unapata mtu unamsalimia habari ya leo Jambu. umekula au hujakula mm. kitu cha mae mbili pale kula mwambie ni mimi mimi ndo nimekutuma mbaya mimi nishaadiambia mtu anatafute kesho ofisi <laughs> zile kazi nimepeana hey, kuiva nimepea business card nipigie kesho ofisi call me kuna yeah, mtu nim, kuna boss. mtu pari nilimpia nilimkataza kuwa waiter nikamwambia call me tomorrow hey, i have a job for I you i have a job for you i know As someone you are you're too beautiful for this job <laughs> not you should not be doing this job you should be doing a blow job kwani job gani uko namuitia kwanonga mtu za maana alafu nguruwe inafungua tu mdomo acha hizo nana na kanguruwe kata mimi na wewe lakini kuna 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 msanii nchai mwambie nda kupangia collaboration na x-ray pombe ni mbaya wewe jamaa anafuata dile so in this this day zetu ziko ziko fiam sasa tunataka kutoka nje place ni place fulani ya kujiburudisha sasa tutamea kutoka kwa bahati mbaya ama nzuri tuki confuse exit na entry <laughs> so bahati mbaya ama mzuri tukaanza kutoka kwa entry And then uh, this girl over said akaanza tu hey wewe umekuja hapa na umesijui umefanya nini sijui nini nini akakasirika tu over said you get akatuambia amwezi tokea hapa unakuwa na entry eh yeah, nilikuwa natoka na entry na exit na, na exit eh yeah. so monti unasema tu kwa sauti na unafurahi ulitoka na entry no si, si furahi nilikuwa nilikuwa juu ya madawa hakuna madawa zioni exit Hey. Watu walikuwa meja hapo kwa kwa nini? Kwa exit. Yeah. Oh, so uko na Joyce si mtu. Kwa entry. Joyce ni ndege wende utoke na entry. Mm. So so hiyo kwa tika hiyo harakati ya kuvurugana issue ikatoke. Gafla bin vu tukafungia hiyo base. Hao sio wakapigia masanzi. So masanzi wakakuja. Sasa hujasema pate yenye chakula letu wamemwaga. Hii time kulikuwa na kukutana yangu cocktail wamemwaga. Jamani cocktail ya ungenchapa usinwage cocktail hata niende nayo jela. Ah uh, ah. Uh. Uja mali ni chapa na akamwaga cocktail yangu na mchele yangu tamu. Tunaweza unajua ulikuwa ushaondoka hiyo masaa. Ah, Kuna mis... mchele uliniachia kando hivi na na pork rib. Huyo polisi aliangusha mchele. Jamaa alikuwa huko watchman alikuwa hapo ndio. Si hata polisi. Hapana. Mjantumia pchoo ndogo nimuone jamani. <laughs> Nataka kujua mpunga ilimfanyia nini. Alimwaga mpunga wangu chini. Alimwaga mpunga. Hakujali. So, after hizi story zote sijui hiyo mchele umemwagika, sijui umevurugana, sijui drink imemwagika bla bla bla. Ah si wakatufungia hiyo base. So wakaita mapolisi. So si tuko najua time hii nimesema mapolisi. Niko najua time umeita the police officers inamaanisha this case. <laughs> <laughs> this case will be handled well. Ni hata tu hata mapolisi at the police officers. Tukaje hiyo time sasa vitu zitakuwa better. Sasa polisi wamekuja. The law the law enforcement. The voice of reason what really took place kwa sababu the fact that umekosea ku, ku, ku exit na entry It doesn't count for you kumagiwa. Kupigwa, kumagiwa, kupigwa coffee. Kupigwa, kupiga Dante coffee. Yeah, na kumwaga mpunga kupiga, wangu. Kumwaga siju chakula. Thank na, you. You know all that because we've been place ya enjoyment. So, is of reason to me buy from buy from that place. As if I was in the core vandalized in the same place yenye tume buy. So tuko na jua police ikikuja, these are cases yenye tuanza kubonga na sema eh, hao sema tufanya hivi hivi na hivi. To my surprise, wali, simu yangu alivunja nilisahau. Walifika tu hivi. Si Dante hadi imevunjika. Kitoko na Dante alekelewa kofu moja mzito. Jamani polisi nime dhani wewe ndo utasema. Sasa nilifanya sikini ni wanane chapa. Alekelewa tu. Tuko kofu hizi lips zilitingika. Nikiwa nami nikianza kuwa polisi nikuje pemko hivi wawili na kesi na kupiga kofu Dante. Lakini alikuwa anaongea. Kubu anakaa na ndarao. Nimkupiga tu kofu. Jamani. Lakini Trevor Sant sana ulentoa pale asubuhi. Alikuwa anaongea. So hii kesi ikaenda up kukua side yetu ika ikaenda up ni as makosa ilikuwa yetu mingi makosa ilikuwa yetu fully you understand mkaenda ndani yeah tuka wacha nikwambie akuna kitu mbaya kama unaingia jela na zako zimeshika juu unajiambia iko nini mm. bombo <laughs> iko maneka jela saa sita usiku zinashuka saa sita ni mapema vibes cartel twende kwa una baridi na go ngina itonga escoba esco i can stay here for 24 years pablo unamjua wangu Mm. Sasa anajiita Pablo ehe. Satisa, Satisa inafikanga hivi huyo Pablo anatoka. Pablo alitoka akaita Escobar. 
akasema Pablo mimi na Escobar cha tuende. Baridi ligonga pale. Monti kwanza alikuwa na t-shirt. Ilikuwa inafika asubuhi hata hauna argument. Unataka tu sikie. Nataka kwenda wao. Tunaweza wapea ngapi tuende? Tuongee tu. Uko ready kuba game. Uko ready, uko ready deadly. Una get? Design added time tulikupigia. Tuko tumekuambia price iko fixed. Rudia hiyo time watu wanataka wanafaa skill. Tuli ile mtu pigia kile anaitwa ambaye ako nje ambaye ako free. Free mm. the free electron. Hiyo freedom na enjoy jamani. Shukuru e, sana. Kama mpigia tumwambia tu jamani tunataka kudoea. Mm. Hii freedom yako bana. Tunaomba. Hiyo time ulikuwa unatusaidia we didn't have an upper hand. Juu kila police alikuwa anakuja ni ah ni hawa. Hao ah. wafungiwe <laughs> hapa hawa. Wanajifanyaga sana mtume pale Instagram. Wafungiwe hapa. Ndio bado unaongea mbaya. Ona, hao polisi. I'm not with them. Mimi I'm too nice to Mi, speak. Mimi hawajaona macho. I'm too fat. Hiyo umeva. Umeva sanga. Ah, kume mimi ndo watashika. <laughs> so, i, i, as in kitu na feel ikiwa kwa level yenye polisi ana ana paradofiti. Hezi kwa na complain sana. Shikilia tu hapo ndugu yangu. Likuwa nakujua vile tunaweza maliza corruption na ukajiseti mwenyewe. Unajua sana tuna complaining tumeongelea sana kuhusu mapolisi na hizi ma story na lives zao zikiimprove au vile zitaimprove tu but corruption si complain tu kama sisi sisi tuna na ni kweli uta complain Kenya iko corrupt iko corrupt eh wase ni corrupt just jua uko hapo ikifika time yenye ni wewe hautaifanya lakini hata mimi ndio mkono hivi ndugu zangu corruption na mimi kwa hii nchi nime support as in mimi mwenyewe nimekuwa kwa situation ya corruption si kuna ata, kwa vitu ndogo kama, kama hiyo ni kesi inafaa kuwa na punishment hey. si pesa lakini mkatuma pesa mkatoka yes ni corruption ndugu yangu hiyo ilikuwa bail ni corruption ana ilikuwa bail mbona unashika huyu si nini tulikuwa na jela huku uliniacha nikaangamia Trevor die with your brother kuna jamaa alikuwa ndani ya hiyo cell na box jamaa nitamani hiyo box nilalie sijai tamani box namna hiyo ndugu yangu alikuwa ndani ile kona niko na huko nikileleshwa huko niko karibu bank yani mko kwa cell lakini bado Nairobi imegawanywa <laughs> eh imegawanywa bwana mtunguji mtu akona box ana ameomoka nani ya Karen akuwa mwenye akona box yeye amelalia box akukileleshwa kwa Karen amua moja kile sio iko na kare ndani basi juu ya mali alikuwa pia kulikuwa na dirisha kadogo kako na grill anaweza chungulia dinja alikuwa na view alikuwa runda huyo <laughs> alikuwa ameomoka alikuwa runda alikuwa ameomoka deadly na corruption unajua inaanza kwa vitu ndogo ndogo hata nyumbani tu kwenu tu nyumbani hapo kwa nyumba sweet unapoa sweet ndo washe viombo ndo washe viombo unapoa sweet julipita mtiani ndakubaiya baiskeli ukipita mm then ki grow ikisha machua ndani yetu tunaanza complete na feel ni the government Yeti lanzi hapa kwa grass. Sisi ni wavivu na tunapenda shortcuts. The only eh correct off. Correct. Hakuna mtu apendi shortcut. Mimi sipendi. So the hakuna mtu apendi shortcut. Najifanya. Ni kuongea tu, mm. najifanya. Nafurahisha. <laughs> <laughs> so vitu kama hizi kitu kama corruption the only way ni zaisha. Mm. Ni dunia izimwe tu. Tuanze tena. Tuanze tena <laughs> afresh. Na new souls, new kila mtu atoke atoke tokyo 3 years old. Lakini tuchukue zile vitu za majuu. Siji ni country gani huko ukishikwa na kesi ya corruption. Hata wewe mwenyewe ukijipata tu umekuwa corrupt unaenda unajinyonga peke yako tu ah hapana bwana wewe mwenyewe tu unaenda kwa forest flani pale unajinyonga sijui ni Japan au ni wapi hizo countries za Asians ukienda huko kama uko corrupt unajimada tu as in huko no, kesi ya corruption m hmm? usipojinyonga ah inchi unajua itaku unajua huko mtaani huko ndio watu wamekuwa barubaru huko unajua hata kushika politician ni kazi huko unajua hata kitambo ushike tu hivi politisha ni hivi yeah. wewe kama polisi jasho kwa mkundu ni mingi uli uliona ngile vida fulani ule mse fulani ule club owner alikuwa na, alikataa kulipa mdem fulani yeye yeah, 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 nakumbuka akimwambia tiende popote pale sijui ama friend to the president nakumbuka, nakumbuka hiyo video, video. naikumbuka vizuri sana nasidani nisha yona hiyo video au shayona ni ka video fulani huyo ja, dem alikuwa na record hivi kama amejificha eh alikuwa na wako okay, ilikuwa okay. sijui ni lodge ama anyway trace okay Aliona kuitisha doa yake huo the owner of the place e, aliongea sana kwaambia pesa yako inaweza kosa kupea na kuna kitu tutafanya mm. i know people i'm a friend to the president akatoa disimu yeah. ndugu yangu tunaonyesha namba ya Ruto uh. kama tu ile yenye alinipea uh. kumbe hata mimi i know people my son i'm a friend to the deputy president uh. not president sasa hii hii culture ina grow design yenye tukishaona hadi na aso yenye wako hapo juu wamenomolize hii shughuli juu unapata anga msee akona kesi evidence ina show kabisa umsee naye huyu amekufanya hii kitu umsee hapa naye amefanya kijana na ficha vitu tuliona kesi ya babu wino 
jamani sijifanya tu kuona jamani kulikuwa na video inaonyesha kabisa ndugu yangu akatua kijiti akagonga naye mwanzake kwa kiti bila wasiwasi next shot next thing gun, gun shot, shot. nyongo Tul- kwa dance floor tulimtoka tu vikliem before, before get real. get real alimchukua pale haraka haraka eh na kulikuwa na every evidence yenye ilikuwa na direct kwake umse amefanya issue huyu anaongea sana ajasikia kidero Mm. Kabisa. Kidero alipelekwa kotini akasema that is not me. I was not there. Adi audio ndio hii. Unajua Kidero you slap me. <laughs> kwa audio mse, mse asema, you, you just slap me. You just slap me na ni video. <laughs> Kidero you slap me audio peke yake ni video. video. Ga, former governor Evans Kidero alikataa akasema ndugu zangu huyo mnaona basi ni kibionzo <laughs> ama <laughs> ni kibonzo. Ndio maana mimi na feel that we blame the normal mwananchi kwa sababu wanaishia na buzz imekuwa set up hivi juu na get as in juu kama kama tushajua Kenya ni connections Kenya ni kinyo, kitu kona what do you have to offer mm-hmm. inamaanisha in every situation you need to decide the difference unapata so in terms of adi vitu za justice as in justice hizi fanyika justice inalingana ina, ina uko na ngapi unanipata nani hey, umetrend una, kwanza una, una, before una, kesi yako isikizwe ilikuwa number one pale twitter unajua nani unaweza pia nani nini ama dongapi unanipata mbona anakoja ngazi trend wa shughulikia mimi kwanza namba 1 si, sijaelewa hiyo vako fulani yenye DCI wako na Twitter handle lenye wana update <laughs> wakifanya investigation wako na mtu wa digital eh as in wako na free time kuna mpaka kuna time walipo mpaka kuna time wanasema fake news <laughs> wadau unajua kwa nini wako na free time wali discuss wa kuwe na digital manager wakamweka kwa base kwa salary mm. wakamweka kwa hiyo list wakasema huyu kazi yake itakuwa tu kupost na kutweet kuhusu DCI Kiamburu. <laughs> okay. Kuna wako na mtu wa digital. Eh. Yeah. Yeah. Wao update up stories zao vibaya sana. Message of time. Mm. Una update stories za nini kwa DCI? Au <laughs> <laughs> vile hiyo ina 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 inasumbua investigation ama na stories. <laughs> Unainua tu hizo stories. Yo guys, we have a guy here he came to complain his dog ate his bike. Uh, uh, Unaikanga live coming to you live from the scene where he was murdered. Yeah, As yeah. you can see I'm holding the t-shirt that he was wearing and, the knife. and here is the knife that he stabbed kwanza hashtag #nainai. Alafu anasema Lincoln bio. Unaona kuona kesi kwa full full. <laughs> Full, full video like, full video on our youtube now channel now out on youtube now out on youtube please check it out eh lakini na share whatsapp groups eh lakini tukiza as in kuna countries zenye uki visit unaweza feel tu wasio wako wako na togetherness flani yenye wanataka kuwa pamoja regardless juu kama ukiingia mali ka Tanzania mali as in una feel hiyo ujamaa imeitikia huku unaweza feel tu hiyo mood tu imekataa kabisa Azin Atam say foreign anaweza kuja ana papers kabisa za kai country okay. lakini ana kai country. Yeah. Jo anajua wasi wawili watatu wenye wako hapa. Mm. Lafu mahali shambweni wakipiga hoodies wakuja waturaruwe. Tunajifanya oh we didn't know. Na wewe ulikuwa hapo ukakubali kabisa ukijana ameingia hapa bila karatasi. Anaishi na watu wenzake hapo ati alikuwa anaishi room number 12. Nasikia amerarua watu huko ubongo imemwagika chini vibaya sana. Na <laughs> Yaani vitu zingine na unanga nasema jamani nchi yetu jamani si tu mtu mmoja tu rosafi na ukisikia mtu ni mzuri analala wakitaja tu mtu mrembo tu kazi yake ni safi na kubalike utasikia amepumzika okay ndio shida mm. so mna feel ina, ina goba kwa leadership yetu eh hey, inaanzia tu pale juu okay kukieza kwa tu juu hata si tunasikianga do fulani ilitolewa ya kufanya nini ikaenda hiyo kesi tutasikia two weeks kwa news Efala. after hapo hakuna kitu tutasikia au jeu na drainage alafu unasikia ti budget yao drainage in 1 million unashindwa kwani ina, inapitisha roho unajua hiyo ni drainage kuna hizi ma footpath fans zilijengwa huko tao ma pavement eh ma pavement huko hivi tao so tuka nikachekia ti yo zimejengwa of which zilikuwa zinaka vizuri sana hizo cabros unajua za colors ni expensive zilikuwa zinaka hadi vilipola kana ka shoot video zilikuwa zinaka vizuri sana by the way but kitu nyingine na reflect ni don yanasema na kazi imefanyika kufanya kujenga ndio ikitokea ile kwa sema sijui ni whatever billions sijui ni 13 billion na shanga eh hey, 13 billion Bro, unatumia kunda nayo acha nikwambie naweza ku break it down mbona ni 13 billion ulisema hiyo cabri kwa wapi nje ya nini tao mm, tao pale CBD kuna sehemu iko pale inaitwa Jivanji hapo watu wa baba wanaendanga ku discuss so tukitengeneza hapa kwanza disruption ya watu wako pale lazima tutoe pesa ya maintenance <laughs> Number 2. Mali tunatengeneza e-cabro kwanza ni wapi CBD. 
Okay. Una pesa tunafaa tu kupea watu ya kuwapigia kelele wakati tunatengeneza. Okay. Sasa unaona hata pesa ijatosha jamaa mtutumie nyingine tunataka kujenga sasa. Serikali inafanya kazi. The government of Kenya delivers. Si umeona pale tika ndo tumeandika? Ina work unajua serikali Kenya na work imefika point yenye hadi deputy president anataka kati yake mkitumia jina yake. Mm. Hapo unajua yenye serikali iko on fire. Mm. Inafanya kazi the hadi deputy president may notice kumba i can earn it. Na wadau hii kitu ya mtu taxi ili nikasirisha wakati waliguza craters. Hii nitafungua tu roho yangu safi muione hapa mbele yenu. Lakini ushinda. Mkitaka mchape. ni mingi. Mimi shidangu iko 15%. Unaweza kama mchukue 15%. As long as nionyeshe venye gava imesaidia creatives kwa hii country kukua better. Watu hawajaban TikTok. <laughs> ah, na dangani kuna countries wameban na states. Gava yetu imekubali so we can earn from TikTok. Unaona countries kama US kama wewe ni creator Instagram inakulipa iko monetize the same way YouTube iko monetized. Unapata pesa yako. Gava ingekuwa ime make negotiations na wasewa meta creators wa Kenya wanapata kitu from videos zenye wana post. Unaweza post video kali kabisa uko na 2.5 million views, uko na comments kama 7000 lakini kwa mfuko yako hiyo siku kwanza ulala njaa. Umelala tu njaa kabisa. 15% ni dom mingi sana. Ukiangalia gava kama ya South Korea huko, wamechukua 1% ya GDP yao wameka tu kwa creative industry. Ukiangalia hada hizo hizo ads zao zile hapa za madoba za nini, unaangalia kazi nyingi kwa hapo ni safi. South Korea sasa ukiangalia movie scene ya ah sasa wame take over Netflix yote na wanaongea tu ki Korea and let me tell you something time in South Korea walikuwa most poor ilikuwa the 1960s time Kenya tulikuwa tunapata independence yetu hmm. Kenya, the Kenyan government wali lend South Korea 100,000 wajisaidie tulisaidia tulisaidia South Korea kwa time tulisaidia South Koreans 100,000 Jomo Kenyatta akasema eh Ah vijana hao wako na macho ndogo wanasumbukana. Wasainie hii. Wape mapema sana. Nilijua tunakuwa na roho safi. Mm? As a country. Lakini sasa hii Samsung wako huko. LG. LG ni huko. Hyundai Motors. Imagine Kenya hadi nilisikia hadi toothpick atunanga toothpick zetu. Imagine hata toyo. Hakuna yetu. Oh. Kijiti Labda uchukue ile visa suri ile ya vijiti ya moto ile ya kijiti. Kuna mtu akuchonga kisu na hakuna mtu akuchonga vijiti. Vijiti. Sticks. Una hata chukua hata ufagio bru mimi mchonge tu. Hata toilet bowls. Unaona hii kitu ya kukalia ya choo ya kukunia. Imagine hata mafi yetu tu hatuwezi jibebea. Tuna na, import Italy, Brazil. Hizi toilet bowls hizi ukiangalia mingi zenye zinakaa fit utaangalia hakuna hata mmoja made in Kenya. Na, na vishida vitu kama hizo ni the fact that atunaga a balanced government. Jukicheki kama for example one of the most balanced governments in the world ni Switzerland. Swi- Switzerland ni Switzerland. Switzerland eh. In Switzerland unapata wanachukua the most actually in one of the places zenye taxes ziko juu. Mm. Tax rates ziko very high. But ukipata easy vitu fulani kama uh, nini uh, medical care ukipata vitu kama education hizo mm. the basic needs za kila msaizo sijui maji electricity mm. ziko on point unapata design unapata wase unaweza kuko huko but uko umesota but everything that unahitaji kwa all check, basic needs basic needs zako ziko in check zote mm. juu wase wako hadi na vitu kama cable tv bla 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 wase wanaweza fanya vitu kadhaa though ana do kwa sababu yes gava inachukua do mm-hmm. inawa tax but kuna reflection hiyo do unapata okay. there is somewhere then that tumecheki yenyewe mm-hmm. hiyo ndio inaenda mahali hiyo ndio inaenda mahali fulani okay. so na feel kama tunyokuwa na hiyo same reflection juu kitu kwa to agree to Nairobi because hatuna drainage system hakuna hakuna drainage system I like mvua tu kinyesha maji imeingia kwa supermarket imeingia kwa choo imeingia wapi kumejaa mm. <laughs> tu maji ni kama dem nono akimwaga kila mahali tu mare umbo wenye Una bada like tukiangalia vitu kama kama nini system zetu za barabara mm-hmm. you see like uh, Kenya Kenya tuko very privileged kukuwa na kwa na, na port, port deadly huko Mombasa unapata mm-hmm. so pata countries kama Rwanda Uganda Tanzania zinategemea kwa in terms of imports mm-hmm. na, na exports zikikuja na shipment okay. unapata si, si ni wase tunafaa kwa tumeiva in terms of transportation na maisha barabara zetu zinakuwa zinafaa kwa in check zote mm-hmm. unapata in Kenya the main roads and to make and check uh-huh. mainly uh-huh. the main roads unapata kuna place one pale vote TRM hiyo sijui TRM drive 
Barabara ina kashamba unashanga eh rada ni gani Na ni Nairobi hiyo Na ita ita imeota Nairobi so ni unda hadi nusu Sasa hivi wameunda nusu TRM drive mm. eh waliunda hadi nusu kutoka kwa TRM hivyo kuipanda wallahi mm. hadi get ya TRM pe inaishia wakamaliza Na nafikiria so, kama gava ita solve easy basic uh, problems hizi za barabara food eh, security corruption hizi sha Huh? Na, na, na feel ni, yes true and to add on, the, on it ni kukua na hiyo a balance a balance system una, una get mm. like ido fulani imetoka inafanya hivi na reflection ya hii ni hii mm. ido fulani imetoka inafanya hivi na reflection ya hii ni hii mm. juu vitu kama kama kina na feel kuna talent mingi sana za football mm-hmm. but unapata ile rate yenye government invest kwa ku find out hizo talents na ku kujua zinaweza fanya nini na nini na nini na nini hakuna mm-hmm. unapata juu kiangalia position yetu tuko in africa tu kwa position ya ku ya host vitu kama afcon mm-hmm. host hizo vitu fulani tuseme tuseme kama tungekuwa tuko kwa level fit tunaweza mm-hmm. study world cup inamaanisha hiyo hiyo ni kitu imetosha tu peke yake imetosha ku improve gdp ya kenya imetosha ku improve living standards imetosha ku improve vitu mingi sana kenya tournament kubwa tumeos ni sekafa unaijua anga eh sekafa ni yo yo ni champions league ya kenya ya ya africa eh okay. ah hiyo champions league ya africa ni nyingine zikafa kaf siji kanini okay okay kuna sasa sekafa, sekafa ni ni sisi kina uganda malawi hapa east kini. africa kitu kama hiyo Eastern Eastern Africa. Eh hey, na bado tu lose tu kwetu. <laughs> Mimi na feel gava yetu makosa inafanya anga ina investing in vitu wrong. Wanafoa invest on the creative economy. Hiyo ndio. Siongee hivyo na tuliweka maua kwa njia. Umeona. Hey, Siongee hivyo na tulimport maua tukaweka kwa njia. Hiyo si creative. Those size mekauka but give us time. Azitakauka zote. <laughs> eh hey, ndo namwambia size mekauka give us time. Maua inaweza kwa hata kwa kaburi ndugu yangu mjatutisha. Sasa mimi kitu nafikiria gava ikeza invest on creative economy number one, tunaweza mbali sana. Jumara mingi utapata gava inaikanga do kwa zile vitu zenye actually saidia tola tola hata ukiangalia nasikia kulikuwa na plan ya kuweka cho thika road. Cho. Mm. Kwa kuwa na cho as in Kuna cho pale thika flyover kuiva. Iko. Kuna cho eh. Iko ni sheko jua ndani. <laughs> Iko. Iko ni lipo tena. Tuko juu. Mm, tuko juu sana. Yetu na depend unaishi wapi? Our government delivers my son. Depending on where you live. Yeah. Kuna ile flyover inakuanga, hii flyover iko Thika Road, na ile flyover iko pale mbele ya Delaru, pale karibu Delaru. Mm. Hizo flyovers zili take how long kuisha? Kujapata ile kawia, kuna ile kwa pale Old Soaps. Kutoka tu nianze tu kujua Nairobi. <laughs> Kutoka tu Thika Road ijengwe tu, Thika Road yenyewe ijengwe, akatoa ile Thika Road Konde, mm. hii zilika. Ili kawia sana. But oh. na feel ukisema hivyo na feel una, unaongelea the wrong things. Kwa sababu ukisema gava wanafa ku invest kwa creative industry. As in creative industry na fall under tuza, maybe tuza sema na fall under entertainment. As in kazi ya gava mainly ni ku make sure like the the basic needs hizo hizo vitu basic zenye sasa una, ka, ka for example mse take for example mse menya kwake akona washing machine, mm. akona gas cooker, akona TV bigi akona akona e, unataja vitu za kwangu eh <laughs> akona hizo e. hizo living conditions ziko up to place na maanisha thinking capacity yake sasa si aizi ona msia akona akona washing machine astuke wa 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 umsia akona washing machine mm. wa 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 umsia akona fridge na ina maanisha kama kama gavetu imetoka kwa level yenye kuna basic needs mm-hmm. kuna mzingia zizi tu stua juu kipata wase wengi wenye wameenda majuu reason hawa say wake look back wana chiki eh hey, hey, na country yetu manzi iko nyuma ni juu hizo base Vitu kama hizo ni vitu normal una get as in mse kukuwa na gari ni vitu normal uh-huh. mse kukuwa na washing machine kukuwa na nini ni vitu normal unapata juu in the long run gava yao venye me invest in back to the people imefanya hizi zikakuwa vitu za kawaida si si big deal so na maanisha in terms of having the the magical the magical ideas the million dollars ideas ina maana ni rahisi kwa sababu at least mse saizi afikiri tu kukula afikiri tu kitu atavaa peke yake una get uh-huh. like our thinking haiko haiko haijafungiwa iko, iko wide enough so i gava yetu kaza invest kwa the the major things for example kupea kupea wase opportunities za kushoot huko Kenya ina maana creative industries mmepata opportunity uh-huh. unapata tukipea nini tukipea na hiyo availability ya wase wanaanza wa construct wanaanza kuwa wanaanza kuja huko Kenya wa invest wafanye vitu kadhaa wase wa kufanya construction huko Kenya wana gain unapata kulingana na hizo 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 loss veziko ilikuwa movie gani sijui ilikuwa shoot ya Kenya sijui wakafanya nini wakaenda sijui kuna movie fulani ya Idris Elba hii fulani alikuwa anafanya Netwaje 
Unajua hii movie? Unajua hiyo movie? Sijui si beast. Najua lakini ile anakonga na accent ya Nigeria. Hiyo movie hiyo flani. Mm. Eh yeah, like I was say wali contact shoot hiyo movie Kenya but the rates aziko zina walao. Mm-hmm. Ikabidi uende Uganda. Ukicheki kama kama Twitter kuna time Twitter walikuwa wanataka kufungua the first ever office in Africa. Mm. Wa, Wakacheki kulingana na venye positions za countries ziko waka choose Kenya. Mm-hmm. But wangeza kufungua Kenya kwa sababu hizo rates aziko zina walao. Wakaenda kufungua ofisi yao Ghana. Mm. So unapata hizo ni vitu zenye gava yetu waki play part nayo. Sisi warrange dot na tuna tuna benefit ina create employment pia watu watacha complain oh jobless eh unapata hiyo like, uh, kampuni si nataka employees unaona hiyo ndio kitu gana wame do ukitaka ku shoot gana wewe unakuja tu gana <laughs> if you want to go and do a production in gana oh. as an investor ukifika gana kitu unafaa kubeba tu ni idea peke yake personnel hiyo hiyo wase wako watafanya hizo vitu zingine zote so unapata In terms of kama we ni director when producer unataka kufanya cinema rates za huko zishakuwa lao juu ukifika huko kuna wase wana wa camera kuna wase kuna as in, kuna support personnel yenye huko na hiyo inasaidia hiyo 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 economy huko ku grow juu kuna vijana huko ready washapata mboka kuna okay. siwasha huko Kenya tu kwanza ufike tu kwanza mitambo tu kwanza unalipia tax tu ya camera kuingia airport uanze kwanza ulipe tu kwanza Mbo, why are you here you are white payment for your whitening kweli kweli and and, <laughs> and apart from hiyo ju na, na feel yes kuna kuna hiyo part flani ya kuangalia huyu investor mwenye anakuja Kenya mm. like ana anakuja kufanya nini uh, tunaweza tunaweza fanyaje vitu zikuwe rahisi mm. for, for him or her to invest Kenya as in hiyo ni only one side of the story tukiangalia on the other side kuna kuna rules zenye zinafanya yes who investor akishafika Kenya huyu msemanya kwa Kenya ana benefit aje Yukiche kama zile story flani za sijui China Square za nini. Mm. Yes kuna investor but nani ana gain by the end of the day. Mi kwanza hiyo story hiyo ch- story ya China Square kitu ilikuwa inanjamisha ni Walai kuna one ya business. China one business it bring the whole country to a stand still. Duka moja hivi. Walai ni upuzi. Duka moja hivi. Unataka kuniambia tax ya hiyo base ita change life ya kila mkenya hapa. Eh hey kumanza kuzesa wali ngumu. Eh, Nika ile story yangu. Ujayo na ujayo chekizi kwa jeza sinalo maandika nga visit Rwanda. Ah, nimecheck yeah, nimecheck. Yeah, yeah. Wana nanga hizo shit wana visit hizo mamta. Yes. Wanauza wana hadi kwa time jekola alikuwa huko. Wanauza hey. country yao ni story na ma traveling agencies stuff. Okay. Hmm. Wanauza country yao watu waenda one views nini unanipata. So kila time hiyo watu wanataka tu kwenda Rwanda. Jo wana yona wana yona frequently. Eh hey, wana use. I think ni kitu flani ya investing back to your people. Like, so unashangaa vitu kai hizo mbona Kenya tuna vitu kai hizo jamani. Unajua unajua nataka nione pale kwa jezi ya Manchester. Mm. Visit Roysa. Visit Roysa. Umecheck? Mm. Mm. Eh small Niger. Sasa odao mimi hiyo kitu umesema unaona kama hiyo shughuli flani ya Rwanda. Kuna kitu iko Rwanda yenye watu wanakuanga questioned about what they are doing. Kama uko kwa gava kuanzia eh the president ma CS eh, ma ministers ma MP kila mtu wanakaa ni meeting moja unakuwa questioned umekuwa kidu nini na nini imekuwa kidu na kila mtu akwa hapa ni panel yenye imebeba wase wote officials ulisema utafanya hivi ulifanya ulifanya uli okay. promise maji after two years kuna maji reason nini gava president akwa hapo si doi ilitoka budget si ilitoka barabara iko wapi kenya kukeza kwa na kitu kama hiyo tutatumama fala wote home Eh na mimi nataka mimi ni kwa president. Mm. Eh. Nataka nataka MP wa Ruisambu na MC wa Ruisambu. Lakini mimi nataka nataka hiyo barabara iliwakosea nini? Nataka ukuwe president juu ya jambo moja. Nini? Nataka ukonde. <laughs> Umse mkata konda dia kaenda. <laughs> juu wasio ki na mtu akikuwa hold responsible ya mandate yake mm. itakuwa easier ju, ju, kwanza kitu kwanza ina feel kitu kuna very many so many seats kwa gava zenye si necessary sijui kwa, 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 kwa the same the same place kuna governor mm. kuna senator in the same area region tunaongelea mm. kuna governor senator kuna mca kuna women rep kuna sijui nani wa vijana kuna sijui mzee wa nyumba kumi mm. like hiyo 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 inafanya na kwa ngumu cold msi accountable mm. kuja kwa huyu anakupeleka kwa huyu huyu anakupeleka kwa huyu so kiwa na hiyo tukiona hizo simpler seats zenye mm. ni rais cold msi accountable mm. kama kitambo vya tuko najua 
kwa district Rwanda sijui ni DO ama nani ndio mwanda wewe mbona hii inaijafanyika ni race cold msia accountable ama rather kama ita menye kuko hivyo kuko na kuko na kama portal enye wase wana wanaenda hapo hivyo wana update like ukipewa uh-huh. ukipewa kazi ya kufanya kitu fulani wana update hapo okay. ulifanya hivi 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 na hivi ilifika hapa na hapa kuna details ndio wala sana jitaga patriot uh-huh. of the country wanaishi hapo wanacheki rada ni gani true wanacheki uh-huh. eh wasianze kulalamika twitter oh gava inasema ga hivi naifanyi inasema ga hivi naifanya yake na bonfas uh-huh. wanafika huko wanatoa update rada ni gani tunajua uh-huh. kuna nuka mavi ama kuna nuka shonde true true wazi na ma police wapo kamera wa vai hivi ndio wakati nampia chai ga. serikali pia inajua huyu amekunywa chai mpunguzie mshahara lakini polisi ongezewe mshahara bana nimeona polisi wa nini wa US bana 50 50000 dollars hiyo ni average kutembea changa sema anapata 32000 Kenya shilling eh it and it wa huko ni 50000 dollars wa Kenya kwanza ana viatu unajua ni pesa ngapi sijui lakini jua 50000 wa Kenya kwanza uniform ni moja. Uniform za kaza high school tu, 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 we want to appreciate our police officers bana. Wako sawa. We preview living standards, we preview kila kitu. Wana ngi uniform ni blue. Aim for this class. This sky. <laughs> See you next week wa dau. Check check. <laughs>